G'day, so I'm trying to install Bazit on my ROG Ally X and I'm getting this error message when I'm trying to delete the petitions to get it going. It's got device is active. And what I've heard is it doesn't fully delete the petitions or it thinks Windows is in sleep mode. So what I'm going to do is connect up a Windows 10 installer USB, boot off it, and then run a couple of commands to completely erase the internal SSD and I'll see if I get this message again at the end. So let's proceed. So to begin with, I'll be grabbing a USB. I'll grab this one. Just one of it floating around. And I'm going to switch out to here. Now if I hold the volume down while powering, I should be able to get into the BIOS and then be able to select the boot manager. So if I turn this off, press and hold the power. Now if I'm holding volume, I think volume down and power. And keep holding volume down. Might be able to see it up here. Sorry about my poor filming right now. Let's see where we get to. Booting, booting. Select boot device. I need to top that up for me. No, it just does not like my lights. I'll try and make this slightly better. Just slightly. There we go. Now I'm using a USB keyboard and I'll go to here. Right, so it's asking to set up. I'm just using my keyboard here. I go next, next. I go repair, next. I go US, troubleshoot. I want to go command prompt. And from here, I'm going to type in disk part list disk. Now it's loading up. List disk. Uh, what have we got? Disk part. Enter. Now I'll type in list disk. And I see there's two disks. I want to select disk 0, which disk 0 is the internal drive. Uh, and with disk 0 selected, all I want to do is type clean, hit enter. Disk part success is successful or succeeded in cleaning the disk. So now I'm going to boot back up Bazit and I'll see how I go. Let's find out. So back on here and my camera doesn't want to capture it but right now I have 476 gig capacity of, and of free space. So I've entered a username, I've gone installation, if I go begin creating BTRFS so right now, no error message. So overall, that looks like with the, with the internal SSD completely wiped of any petitions, it looks to be happy to be able to proceed to install. A bit weird that the petition manager doesn't enable you to fully de delete the whole drive, but it is what it is, and I hope that helps you. Sorry about the quality of the video and the amount of cuts. Did have a few people coming in the store, but hopefully that helps you with your as an installation. Bye.